Welcome back to Road to the Super Bowl with the Washington Commanders theme team. We are trying to make the playoffs in today's episode. And if we get a rage quit in our first game early, then I will be playing our first game of the playoffs in this series. As of right now, it's Wednesday. We have gotten no new cards, but we are getting some new commanders tomorrow. So far out of the cards that have been announced, we are getting a Cameron Curl and a Fabian Moreau. I don't have Deion Sanders, so Fabian Moreau is going to start. And obviously Cameron Curl is starting right now for us. So that is a great upgrade for the team. The rest of the cards are being announced during the MCS stream. Make sure you guys go watch that if you want to get the free Trayvon Diggs. But that is enough. I'll go over the lineup briefly and then we will get right into the gameplay. Looking at our offense, we've got a couple high-end cards like Trent Williams, RG3, Art Monk, uh, some supporting cast guys like Terry McLaurin, Andre Reed, Antonio Gibson. They've all been surprisingly very good. And then on the defense, like I mentioned, we are getting a Cameron Curl tomorrow, 88 overall. It's going to be 90 speed on the theme team, which is great. Our corners are really good. Porter, D'Angelo Hall, and Champ Bailey. We're going to be adding Fabian Moreau. We are using the Eagles offense and the Chiefs defense. And last episode did not go as we wanted it to. So we definitely got to get back in the saddle. And and just go back to absolute domination with the Washington Commanders theme team. Hopefully you guys enjoy this episode and hopefully we win some football games, man. That being said, let's get right into the gameplay. There is our top three. Looks like we're playing in Dallas Stadium. This is a Cowboys theme team. That'd be a great matchup. And unfortunately, it's not a Cowboys theme team. But our opponent's top three is really good. And I do want to let you guys know, I'm not entirely sure if this series is going to stick on the channel. What I am going to promise you guys is that I will finish the Super Bowl run with the Commanders theme team. But with Blitz around the corner... I'm definitely going to sell off my team just to maintain a good coin stack. And then I've been considering building a Legends theme team, starting up a second channel, doing daily videos there, and reverting back to our old ways with, you know, the theme team updates just as the year goes on. And I know that's kind of a lot just to include in this episode randomly, but that's where I'm at with my thought process right now. So I'm going to give the Washington Commanders team a shot. Like, we're going to go through the entire season until the Super Bowl. Hopefully we win it, and then I'm going to move from there. All right, here we are. I'm on London Fletcher. You're going to throw it at my user, and that is going to probably be a pick six. Nope, Jason Wynn's going to catch us from behind, but we are starting off this game hot. Maybe a potential rage quit if we score here. We'll see. I also really like the way our, our opponents lined up on defense. We got a first and 10. Read this end. I should have given it. I, I, I don't think I've gotten a single read option right this entire series. I've ran probably like six. Looking at a high ball to Art Monk, honestly. Um, I don't think it's open. I don't think uh, we might have had that last. Uh, we might have had the post. Just get the ball out. Third and 13. So I'm going to do the same thing. I'm going to make sure we're getting Gibson on a viable route if I want to check down. But let's look at Art Monk here. Um, again, I don't think I have anything. I'm just going to try to scramble here with RG3 and nothing's there. It's good defense from our opponent. And uh, I'm going to end up taking three here. I wish I could have got seven there, but taking points off of turnovers is how we win football games. So I'm not entirely pissed that we're taking three here. All right, here we go. So we definitely got to watch out for that Devontae Adams in the slot. He's going to have runoff elite and then another weird ability. Zeke's going to gash us up the gut here for a first down. Not the end of the world, but going to make sure we look for that. So I'm going to be here in the hole. Looking for that again at the tight end. I know he is. He's going to throw something short and we can't get animation with our corner. That could have been an interception. Now it looks like he's just going to go heavy set. Oh, he got the underneath. Oh my God, London Fletcher. I didn't even press Y. Not going to lie, did not press Y. There we get another interception with our user. That is crazy. But what we want to figure out on this series is how am I going to beat this cover two man? We've seen cover two man a lot this series. And I, to be honest, I really haven't beaten it. Make sure we don't turn this ball back over. More points off turnovers is going to you know, pretty much solidify. I'm going to throw Y. It looks like we're going to have to work underneath versus this dude. It's slow. It's frustrating, but he's doing a good job of keeping everything in front of him. We're going to try something out here. I think Z-Spot will work with his user responsibilities. Oh, I'm just going to take A. Guaranteed yards, Dave Casper. Going to turn up here. Going to break a tackle, and we are inside the 10-yard line just like that. Perfect. All right, call me, call me crazy. But I'm going to read option again. Does he have inside stuffs? He has one inside stuff, so... I guess we'll double that. No, I'm just going to hand this off. Antonio Gibson up the gut and pick up three there. I just really want that end to bite. End didn't bite. He clicked onto the D tackle and got us behind the line. Lost two. Okay, his user's right there on Derwin James. Pass lead that out. Andre Reed, what a dot. What a dot. Okay, now nah, that was a sketchy throw. His click on could have been a little bit better. We're going to take a two score lead here. 10 nothing in the first quarter. We haven't even really played the best on offense. It's our defense has really stepped up. London Fletcher with two picks. Oh, that's good. That's solid. We'll take that. Take that straight to the bank. One more pick and we're definitely looking at a rage quit playing our second game, which is going to be our first game of the playoffs. Yeah, I'm expecting a pretty aggressive series here. He's going to try posting the ball downfield. 
No runs. I'm going to be on this crosser. Going to have to check down. That's a good play. Smart play. Smart play. Oh, that was a good play. That was good. I thought he was throwing to Devontae Adams. I thought that was going to be another interception. That was actually a good seam route. The lineman's pretty garbage. Going to cut back with Zeke. Just doing a ton of stuff with Zeke here. Going to get 10 yards, 9 yards right there. Devontae Adams. Up the gut. Zeke looks like he's just going to resort to running the football. Might have to get into nickel normal. Yep, he wants to go single back wing pair. So I'm going to bring out the nickel normal. And we're going to be man coverage all the way across. He's going to throw to Derrick Henry. Thankfully, D'Angelo Hall is able to tackle him. And we're almost at the two-minute warning. This half has flown by underneath. He's going to run the ball again. Derrick Henry tackled down. And it's fourth down. I'm going to call a timeout. Minute 36 left. I would be really surprised if he doesn't throw the ball right here. Fourth down and three. I'm going to be on Cam Curl. Five-yard line. Got to get a stop here. Not S right there. Right there. Easy money. We, I kind of baited it. And only if this video was recorded tomorrow, we would have the full speed Cam Curl. Even though I don't think it matters. I don't think it matters. Nah, we're definitely getting caught. We're definitely getting caught. Unfortunately, he's only like 84 speed, but I don't think it's going to matter because that looks like a rage quit. We're in the playoffs, man. First season with the Washington Commanders team team. Making the playoffs. Did I expect this? Yes, but I'm still excited. So let's get right into it. Wild card playoff round, I think. Dean Hunter, Muck Coins, a Duck Wing. Oh, we got a game day pack. This is a you know, very rare sighting. Jock doing a pack opening on the YouTube channel. Get a Kendall Fuller. Okay, Washington Commander, 85 overall. Nothing crazy there. Uh, we get a Legends card, Art Monk. Give me Art Monk, please. Not 89, Dante Hall. 81, Brandon Cooks. That's, I mean, dude, 89. We're just giving these out for free now. Yeah, okay. You guys can see it says we have two more wins this Super Bowl. So I think that means two playoff games. All right, we've got the Phantom Top 3 once again. Hopefully that's my Top 3. You can see his Top 3. No, there's our Top 3. Okay, so I have no idea who I'm going against. But we're in the playoffs. Just do or die. Is we're going to be able to run the ball all over this dude. Up the gut, Antonio Gibson makes a great cut. That's gonna be five yards. We can get five yards every run. We are chilling. Cover four quarters. Interesting. Interesting defense. <laughs> He's screaming. He's also screaming. 99 Aaron Donald did not check abilities. All right, so going forward, we're probably gonna have to call slide protection to Aaron Donald's side because I bet he has edge threat double or nothing. Okay. We're gonna make sure we're doubling Aaron Donald. I'm gonna block him. We're gonna run a normal curl there. Looking at Art Monk. Yep. Looking at Art Monk right there. We have Deep out of lead on him. He's going to actually break a tackle and get a first down. Okay, good, good, great. So we cover four. The sideline should be open, especially with our fastest receiver out there like that. All right, so once again, I'm trying the read option. Watching that left end. He's actually crashing. We're going to take it with RG3. Use your speed to get outside. We have blocks set up. And oh my God, we just need to get out there a little bit faster. Still a 12-yard gain though, so that's really good. All right, so he's going to be in cover three again here with the one-eye safety. I'm going to throw. Ah, wow. That's crazy. I could have, I should have highballed that. I should be highballing everything. That is just a crazy lurk animation. Okay. I messed up my defense. Messed up my defense horribly. All right, here we go. See if this dude's got it dialed in. I'm on Fletcher. He's just going to throw something up and that's going to be an interception. Let's go. D'Angelo Hall. See if we can get good field position on this. Swerve out. Great field position so far. Swerve. Dan. Oh, we got shoestring. We're still on the 50 though. So we're right back where we started. I should have waited and thrown B. B was wide open. I wonder if he's going to pick up that I am double teaming Aaron Donald. RG3. Ah, I cross body. I'm leaving the pocket way too early. Okay, third and 10, 49 yard line. Still looking Andre Rea on the cross here. Honestly, I just want him to overplay play the slot. Don't know if that's going to happen. We'll see. Yep, there it is. High ball, Andre Reed. Learn my lesson. We're going to be down on the 25 yard line. All right, here we go. We are back to the read option. He's bringing his safety down so we can pop this. Nah, it doesn't look like it. I didn't mean to pull it. I didn't mean to pull it. I pressed A. I guarantee you I pressed A. Don't know if we're going to have it, though. If anything, I'm throwing a high ball to Art Monk, but I also don't want to risk, like, turning the ball over. Let's just see what we got. Coverage sack. I mean, maybe the cross over the middle, but I saw his user come down. Third and 14. Gash with Gibson. That'd be great. Duke... And that's going to get us like six or seven, fourth and eight, 23 yard line. I'm going to take three. You know, we are, we are playing for the series on the line, potentially the Washington Commanders theme team on the line. Three nothing with three minutes left. He gets ball to start. So if we get a stop here, get points for half, that's going to be really good for us. He seemed to be very aggressive on offense. mismatch it's a mismatch he's got art monkeys running on cam curl 
he wants to run the ball, that's cool. He is going to run the ball, and I'm going to fill that gap with our safety, but not after getting nine yards on that. Okay, he's make, making sure he's chewing the clock down, and that's going to be a mid-zone KO or mid-route KO, whatever you want to call it. Fourth and one. It's a good play. Off the block. That's too much. Way too much there. Yeah, what do we got? Third and goal. He's going to pass it. He's going to look Barry Sanders. No, he's going to run. Ah, oh, damn. Couldn't get him. Couldn't get him. Good touchdown. Still have a timeout left. 40 seconds, I think. Trying to lock in. Gave up a little bit too much there. All right, so our opponent probably going to be in dollar. I am looking over the middle. I think he's going to be on that. Yeah, he's going to recognize that. I'm going to just take off with RG3, slide down, and call our last timeout. It's around the 38. Got to get points here. Cover four might be a tough one to break. He actually caught that too. I actually caught that. So maybe I'm being a little bit too conservative. Just need to chuck it downfield. We're down 7-3. He's starting with the ball. Need to stop here. Like absolutely need to stop. Terrible, terrible, terrible way to start off the half. Not looking good. I'd Cole Hoko manned up on Art Monk. Think about this defense. I either have to run zone or cover zero, and I just have all man abilities, so it's like, do I really want to run cover zero? No, but I kind of have to. So now, unfortunately, I'm 14-3. Not looking good. Got to just open up the playbook. I really don't know how to beat cover four, to be honest with you, which is why I was happy he got out of cover four and went into cover three, but now he's back in cover four. So I'm really, I can't run the ball. I could, but I mean, do I really want to waste time? Okay, here we go. Second and 10. I'm looking for a post to Art Monk. Don't know if it's going to be there, though. Gonna have to check down. All right, here we go. Third and seven. We have a slant on that side. Probably just going to check down. Fourth down, of course. It's a great ball. Absolutely phenomenal pass. A little quick hike there. Never killed anyone. Let's go inside zone. See if we can pick this up on the ground. If we get a rushing touch on here, that'd be phenomenal. Up back, just really not a whole lot there. Gonna go hurry up again. Nope, never mind. Oh, yep, RG3 on the ground. RG3 on the ground, get his stake out of bounds. There's a big touchdown if we can get it. Go and read option, probably just giving this one on default. Gibson can't fall forward. Let's go hurry up. Don't want to show him I'm running read option. Just get in, Gibson. God, why do we make it so difficult? Gonna get in. Gonna get in. This is actually ridiculous. My goal line offense is so bad. It's the only thing about Gibson is I don't know if we have the speed to get outside. I'm gonna call toss. I'm gonna call toss, but like I said, really don't know if we have the speed to get outside on this. Nope, we can't even get a block there. I don't know who that is, but they don't know how to block the corner. Okay. Yeah. Gonna have to watch the tight end, and hopefully our pressure just gets there, to be honest, because I don't blocking everyone oh we have the ko but is that who's 18 is that as justin jefferson who just came out yeah definitely don't want to make excuses at all but we are going out against art monk justin jefferson rg3 like this is a god squad and i don't know what champion he was doing right there because i gotta see what play that was that's kind of ridiculous that he just gets beat, beat off the line like that unfortunately i'm just not good enough to offset the disadvantage in personnel that we have I enjoy building different theme teams and selling my team and stuff. This is just not the part I enjoy, is getting matched up with God Squads. And, like, I just have so many disadvantages just off lineup and personnel alone that it's, like, it's overwhelming, to be honest. Especially, like, I'm not really good at the game at all right now. So, so is this the last time we'll see the Washington Commander scene team? Maybe. Do I have other plans for the channel? Yes. And I think I'm going to go through with those plans. It's... It's a good idea on paper, but once we get into these gameplays, like, I really have to just play lights out. Oh my god, did he just get off the ground and sack me? I just don't have enough in the tank to close the gap between the Legends theme team and the Commander's theme team. Good idea on paper, but I need to get better at the game 
in order to carry out this series. So uh, going forward on the channel, we're probably gonna stick to the regular schedule or the regular thing, the way, regular way we've conducted things here. Cycling through the theme teams, giving you guys rankings. Rankings will probably be out tomorrow, to be honest. Going through rankings, using theme teams, pretty much just being the overall theme team hub of uh, Madden YouTube. So hopefully you guys enjoyed. Series was a good idea on paper, but did it translate into the gameplay? Kinda, kinda didn't, but you know, we tried at least. That being said, Jack sign it.